This is Lenny Farley, Purdue University Extension Forester. Now let's ID that tree. In this edition of ID That Tree, we're going to help you identify one of our understory shrubs commonly found here in Indiana, and that is maple leaf viburnum. As you can see, very attractive blossoms. This is the last week in May. We've got these beautiful clusters of flowers on the tops of the stems. Also, you can see where it gets its name. Leaves very reminiscent of red maple. As is the case with all of our viburnums, this has opposite leaf arrangement. Simple leaves, and as we mentioned, leaves very similar to those of red maple. <clears throat> uh, we can tell this apart from red maple because it never gets to be tree size. Uh, so this is always a shrubby plant, although we can have stems that are overhead high in many cases. Uh, and oftentimes found on dry ridge sites, but we can find it in other locations as well across the state. And we've got a little bit of a bonus with this one as well. Not only is it in blossom, but we're also in the middle of a periodic cicada emergence. And this particular one has a couple of our periodic cicadas, uh, 17 year cicadas from brood 10 that have emerged and are now on the leaves, kind of getting warmed up and no doubt getting ready to sing as part of their mating ritual. So a very attractive blooms, also produces good cover for wildlife in the understory, and some food value in the fall when these flowers turn into fruit that wildlife will utilize oftentimes through winter. So maple leaf viburnum, one of our native viburnums in Indiana, a great shrub that you could utilize in your woodlands or maybe even for decoration in your yard.